Hey guys, so today I wanted to share with you all the steps I took to build this incredible wood slat wall. I looked at several videos to inspire myself. I wanted the wall to be made out of hardwood, specifically red oak. Enjoy. The first step to the project was planing the wood. I used the Ryobi 12 inch planer for this and it was quite impressed by its performance. The wood I purchased is 6 quarter red oak. For my situation this step was a bit complicated because my wall is 11 feet high so I needed 22 feet in my garage in order to pass it through the planer. This was my first time planing wood. Overall, everything went well. I didn't realize how much wood dust this planer creates. Although, as you can see, pretty much all the wood chips got picked up with my shop back. The next step was cutting up the wood. I don't have a jointer, so I had to make myself a jig that acts like a jointer. I created this jig with a baseboard. I used a baseboard because I know it has a straight side. I then removed 1 8 of an inch of material on the side of the baseboard, which is the thickness of the blade. The length of the cut needs to be 2 thirds of the length of the baseboard. I then clamped it to the table saw and used it as my fence. It's important to pass your wood on that jig with the concave side of your piece towards the jig. Once your wood has a straight face, you can then remove the jig and slice your wood in lats. In my case, I cut the slats 1 inch wide. I also cut a scrap piece at 3 quarter inches thick to use as my spacing jig for my slats. I then prepared the wood slats for sanding. I put them on my workbench because I figured it would be much easier to sand all of them at the same time. I clamped them together to facilitate the sanding and to create a level surface. Then it was time to sand. This took a good amount of time. I started with 80 grit and went all the way to 220. I had to make sure all three sides were well sanded before applying the finish. I used the 3M extract sandpaper and I was quite impressed by the performance of it. Uh, it definitely helped in sanding quicker, but it still took a lot of time. So on this step, I'm applying the finish. The finish I used is from Easy Solo Alinea. Uh, it's a monocoat oil for wooden floors actually, and I was recommended this um, finished by my local wood shop. It applied very easily. All I had to do was wait five minutes and then wipe it down with a cloth. I decided to use red oak plywood a quarter inch thick for the backing of my wood slat wall. I applied green tape and used my Ryobi circular saw to make a clean cut. Then it was time to install the slats. Thankfully I had friends and family helping me with the wood slat wall. While I was installing the slats, my father-in-law applied glue to them. I then used my spacer that is 3 quarter inch thick and grabbed onto the slats on each side of the spacer to make sure it had a tight fit. To attach the slats to the wall, I used my nail gun with 18 gauge 1.5 brad nails.
We glued on the red oak plywood directly to the wall. This plywood was used to help keep the wood slats from warping with time. The whole process took approximately one hour to complete. This was the most satisfying part of the whole project. I was able to see what the wood slat wall actually looked like. I had designed it on a 3D software to make sure it worked with the space, but this was just better than expected. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if this helped you out in any way. Also, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.